Hey guys, Colin from Trail Trash ADV here. This is gonna be the last video we released for the summer of 2022. You will see us back here in the fall, so make sure to like and subscribe and we will get some new content out to you come September. I hope you enjoy this video of our brand new rider going out on the trails and really pushing her limits. You'll see the progression of her abilities and her confidence on this ride. It's relatively unedited and uh, has some really good pointers for new riders. So if you're just thinking about getting into riding or are just getting into riding, haven't done off-road stuff yet, check it out. There's probably some stuff to learn. It's Colin from Trail Trash ADV, here with She Who Shall Not Be Named, with a mooncake sticker on the back of her helmet. Beautiful mooncake. So we'll call her mooncake for today. Mooncake is a brand new rider, and this is only her second time off-road. You'll get to see her epic crashes uh, from the other day, probably. You know what, I'll just probably put them in right here. Bam, 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 crashes. <laughs> Anyway, so we have uh, traveled about 30 kilometers on some fire roads, nice, easy, breezy, beautiful fire roads. And so now it is time to hit some logging roads, which will devolve into some trails, which will devolve into a journey to Crystal Falls. So, Mooncake, if you would please carry on that way, and I will oh, come up right behind you. Yes, because when you drop it, I'm going to help you pick it up. Can, uh, can you move forward just a little? <laughs> sure. <laughs> No, I stalled it. Loser. Oh, Start God, a sorry. stall count. Stall count number one. That's that stall count on the trail. I've stalled it three times already today. Shh, we'll keep that to ourselves. So yes, this is an act of logging road, so just keep that in mind. And we're just taking it at mooncake speed today. She's on the Suzuki Van Van 200. Mr. Jeffrey's Van Van 200. What a fun bike. If I wasn't out riding the V-Strom today, I'd be out on the Van Van today making a video about that bike and just how, <laughs> how it's well it handles everything. Oh my god, there's a lot of people. Yep, that's just, there is and there isn't. Like, there's always people around on these trails, but so long as you're respectful of the trucks and all that good drop. stuff, it's a non-issue. So, something drop. to keep in mind, we're yeah. coming up on some wood, right, and some bark. Always yeah. take that slow, because you never know what's going to be underneath, right? Okay. I mean, you look at some of this stuff, and it's, you know, some pretty big pieces of, of lumber. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah, you're doing good, you're doing good. This is turning into sort of sandy sandy terrain but it's not deep so you should handle it just fine with those big fat tires. <laughs> that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. <laughs> oh yeah look at that machine out in the woods there just obliterating trees. Yeah. One thing these guys are going to notice about me really quickly is that I don't pick the greatest climb. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel, bro. <laughs> okay. Yes, you'll you'll learn to pick better lines as you crash more. He, oh well, they're gonna get a lot of my internal thoughts that are. That's perfect. That's exactly uh, what we want. Become outside thoughts. I think they're they're probably gonna get some other tall and level work of. <laughs> I think I think that's exactly what the female rider segment needs. Send her, send her there, guy. Oh, you might as well send her, send her into the bender of a fender. Okay, so up here, just stick to the concrete. 
Just keep on swimming, keep on swimming, keep on swimming, swimming, <laughs> swimming. If, a... if, if this is the right trail, I may have picked the wrong trail. Who knows? This is, oh Jesus, okay, okay, let's go. <laughs> See, yeah, yeah, you're getting her, you're Holy getting her. Holy shit, it's like the freaking moguls when you're skiing, downhill skiing. <laughs> And see, when you stand up on your pegs for the first time, you'll feel the difference. Because instead of bouncing around, just let your knees take all those bumps. Well, but you're brand new. I know. I know, Mooncake. You just just take your easy up there. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh my god, she's doing it! She's standing for the first time. I'm going very slow. Yes, yes, oh. of course. But you're in the right spot. You know, you're, you're just putting your weight into your pegs. Mm -hmm. And uh, fingers over that clutch. Two fingers I, over that clutch. I cannot. I can barely reach the clutch. We gotta fix that. Yeah, we'll fix that. It's not bad though. No, you're doing okay. good. You're doing good. Always okay. having some space okay. over that. Yeah. So this is gonna loop around to the left, and there should be a okay. little lake on there, our left there as well. Oh, crazy! Oh, jeez. You're doing good for a first time. Oh, yay! Beautiful lake oh, shot. That's so nice. Right. Lake shot. The things he makes me do. Yeah, that's open. I don't want to yeah. anymore. Good. Oh, my ass cheek showing. All right. Ready? I'm ready. Oh. Stall number two. More gas. I did. More gas. More throttle. Yeah! <laughs> Throttle is in there, bud! There you go. Hello? I totally forgot where I was. put my foot on If you put your foot on the clutch, I will be impressed. Listen, similar things have happened. <laughs> I can get my foot pretty high if I want to. Um, I should be standing up. Um, yeah. I'm sitting down just to match what you're doing, and yes. Okay, this is where I should be picking better <laughs> line. Okay. Let's Let's take your time. Up. You'll figure it out. I know. The bike will handle 90% of what you throw at it. Yeah. It's all a mental game. That's right. Swing to the left, swing to the right, crisscross, crisscross, ch ch cross. Oh. Ch cha cha, real oh. smooth now. Wah. Are you gonna tell everybody that the other day when I went out that I was following you and we lost comms and you were hopping rocks for fun and I was just fucking smoking them with the <laughs> No, I will not tell them. However, I will show them. Oh okay. yeah, the Jeff perspective is great. You're just like <laughs> you, you're just like putting along, like no, no experience off road. It just it, the rear wheel goes, and it's just like mm, more gas. Let's we'll see what happens. Which one was that? The rock one the, or the water one? The first one. The rock the first one. one. Call it jumping rocks. For fun. Yeah. Just <laughs> prime, prime footage. Too bad my audio wasn't working. Yeah. Freaking GoPro. Ugh. Piss me right off. By design. Yeah, see? And again, just put some weight into those pegs when you see a big bump coming. You don't have to stand up, but putting weight into pegs will help, help soften it. I'm absolutely just clobbering shit. I hope you can see that. Oh, I sure can. <laughs> it's clobber time. I just yeah. fucked the tree. Yeah, fuck the tree. <laughs> fuck the tree. Oh shit. Okay, I need to. I need to reset because right now I'm like. Oh, there we go. The terrain settled out for me. Something. Oh, you mean it. placing your bum back where it's comfortable for you? Is that what you mean? Well, and then I just had to. Well, 
that it mental refresh, like stop trying to hit every bump? Right, yeah. Oh, t typically not hitting every bump is the way to go. Oh shit, which way are we going? This way? Yes ma'am. <laughs> Good. Alright, I do recall there being a somewhat difficult hill climb, but that should be That's about the worst of it. Now I know what you're thinking, you're like, I've heard that before. Yeah, the other day you guys said that there was only one very put her in at first. Yeah, just keep track. Oh my god. You're good, you're good. Here, here, here. Do you want to see me go over it? I want to see which line you pick. Either one would be fine. Kay. Okay. But just hit things straight on. With one sec. Heads. Yeah, you got her. Okay. Uh, can you move up just a little bit? You've got so much space. Are you sure? Yes, I'm positive. And then I'll just cut over to the right? Yeah. Okay, okay. See? Easy. Yep, exactly. And always keeping that right foot on that rear brake. That's how you control your speed. Okay. That and the clutch partially pulled in. That'll, that's the other half of the, right, which the deal. Hard for me. Okay, I'm going to pull over here and just watch the master at work. You coming down or are you staying there? Well, I Cut across here to the right side. Come on. There. There you go. Okay. I want to see what you do. Okay. Yeah, come on down. Beautiful. And again, right left foot. Uh, sorry, right foot on that rear brake. Um, yeah. But okay. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hug just the side of this because I know that the, the the dry side is a little too steep and I'm gonna slide off it. Right, okay. So just me hog the... Yeah. Come on down. You're the next contestant on, on the price is right. Beautiful. Yeah, easy peasy, you got her. I'm just gonna take it nice and slow here. Yeah, and again, feather that clutch so you don't stall where you're going to the low RPMs. That's so hard. I know. People are probably wondering, why is it so hard? And it's because I have teeny, tiny, little hands. I would pick not my line, but... Okay. I see that the right side's quite mucky. I'd stick further to the left. Further to the left, go closer yep. to the tree line? Yeah. Okay. And just take her, take her slow, take her easy. And are there some, is that rocks I see at the end? Yeah, there are some rocks. You always gotta be prepared to hit a rock under the water. I, I am prepared to hit a rock under the water. <laughs> Uh, I just am trying to figure out, okay, I guess I don't have to really think about it. I guess I should just fucking do it, right? Yeah, get your body in position and then... You go. Yeah, you got her. I took the line you took. Beautiful. Yeah, and you're, you, got, you got it right. You're, like, you're giving it enough oh, okay. gas to keep your momentum Is right this side. Is the difficult climb you were talking about? Yes. So here's what I'd recommend. Okay. Right side. Mm -hmm. I'm not even going to stand. Just to, oh wow, yeah, this is quite difficult. But uh, yeah, I'm just sitting just to show you that it can't be done. Okay. Well, stand if you have to. I want you to make it up the hill. Well, I'm going to make it up, no problem. Can you still see me? No, we're gone. Okay. Well, I'm going to come back down. Just give me a, I, just give I me a second. That. 
I'm gonna turn the back off. Okay. I'm coming back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. So yes, there are a lot of rocks. There are a lot of big rocks, mm -hmm. but you've got lots of room to get around them. Mm -hmm. And there are some good lines. Okay. Okay. So you're gonna go right side. Yeah. And then you're just gonna come right up here. Mm-hmm. Okay, nice and easy. And then just stick to the right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And uh, I'll move a couple bigger boulders out of the way but okay. yeah and then once you get up here mm -hmm. you'll see the way you can go okay i trust you when you say that first gear nice and slow there you go yeah i will take try to do that i think i might even start here okay you're good don't overthink it i'm not look at where you want to go Feet on the pegs. There you go. Okay, yeah. Okay, slow down. Clutch, clutch, clutch. I just did it. Okay. What you did yeah. was you gave it gas, but you had no control over what you were doing. Right. Absolutely 100% agree. Do you want me to take it up the rest of the way? No, I think the right side looks pretty good all the rest of the way. All right, get back on. Let's go. All right. Stop your bitching. That's right. Thank you. Okay. <sighs> gas. Clutch. No. More gas, less clutch. Can you take it up the hill? I appreciate you. Wow. Finally get some van van action. is a fucking blast. <laughs> like, it just eats these rocks. I'll try to keep my hand extended out to the clutch, but... Yeah, I mean, you've got to you've got to get your two fingers, your index and your middle finger over the clutch. You yeah, you've got and I, it. Can, I don't know. Probably won't be able to catch it on the camera, but I'll show you next time we stop is that my top finger pads are barely touching the clutch. Okay. So like in order for me to grab onto the clutch, whoop, Okay, left side. Um, in order for me to like, I can't, <laughs> if I have two fingers on the clutch, then the other two fingers aren't on the clutch, aren't on the handlebar. Yeah, no, you, no. You can grab the handlebar with your thumb and your two, uh, you know, smallest fingers there. Which is, yes, which is what I'm doing. And then I'm just resting the tips of my fingers on the clutch to get used to it? Yes, exactly. Okay, but I cannot reach and, the clutch. And you don't really need to grab the bars with your three fingers that hard. No, I don't. But like when I'm going downhill, my clutch is always in and out controlling how much slip I'm allowing. Okay, and I am not doing that. Right, but that's just, yeah, you'll get used to it. You'll, yeah. you'll figure out when you should and shouldn't pull your clutch in. Yes, and all I'm doing right now when in these situations is my hands are on the clutch, but I'm kind of trying to control it. I see what you're saying about the clutch, though. 
I'm trying to control the speed with the throttle, but that doesn't fully cut the power. That's right. And if your rear wheel catches something, right? Right, that's um, going to spin it, me out and knock it'll, me over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So having your ability to pull your clutch in at any time stops that engine rev from turning into wheel spin. Okay. Jeff's poor blinker. <laughs> Sorry, Jeff. I didn't sign a waiver. Am I liable for all damages? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you sure are. Oh, there's a uh, Aurora. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah. Means we're headed to Greenwood. Oh, this is an opportunity for me to pick some better lines. But you got a chance to uh, experience how the van van handles all these freaking rocks. Yeah, it's uh, pretty cushy, gonna be honest. Yeah. <laughs> you felt it, eh? I did. When you get when you hit that precipice of the engine slowing things down and you just pull the clutch in and Did you allow it to it? roll over. Right okay. line. Right line. Yeah, yeah, you're too late, you're in it. Oh, <laughs> Fuck. Well. Sorry. Jesus. Did I cut in front of you? No, no, you're good. It's just what once you once you end up in a line like that, depending on how loose and how raised the middle is, you're sometimes worse off trying to cut back across and just oh. Trying to ride it out. But you're doing well going down all this. For, you know, loose, sharp rock, you're doing quite well. I think it's that might have to do with the van van. Whoops. But it's definitely a bonus. There, breeze. Easy breeze, beautiful cover girl. Now, that is really dried up, shallow mud, so you can pick just about any line with a little rock and you're laughing. Like that one. Good work. Good work, Mooncake. Good you. work. I'm literally not using anything but the clutch and the brake right yep, now. And you're then Holy you're doing good. Shit, balls. No gas. No gas. Yep, brake, rear, rear brake. Drag brake. the rear brake. Use your clutch. Okay, good, it good. Is, it is. I just noticed you're picking up speed Sorry. while simultaneously. Is that you or me? I have no idea. Holy shit, Colin. Do you hear the Google talking? No? Okay. Easy peasy. Yeah. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Rear brake, clutch. Yeah, clutch. Okay, <sighs> before you go, let me come up and yeah. catch it on video. So you could see how that rear wheel kept slipping. Yeah, I can so see. So I could control that with, guess what? Clutch and rear brake. Clutch and rear brake, that's right. Oh! Who's a rock star? You Mooncake are. is. Oh, shut up. Okay. You got this. Okay. I really don't have to give it any gas, do I? No. No. You're controlling your speed with the rear brake and the clutch. And, the clutch. and then I'm just kind of letting the weight of me and the bike. Yeah, but you're going to slip out. Just be prepared for that rear wheel to slip. Keep your right. balance. Keep your. Keep your weight on the peg. And kind of right side is better. Yeah, it'll all depend on which way you think you're sliding, right? Right. Well, whoop, whoop. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to get going without any throttle, because that's what's gonna. What? Yeah, no. You... What? You can give a gas to get going. There you go. Okay. Ooh. There you go. Yep. The... Rear brake, rear brake, clutch, rear brake, slow down. There you go. There you go. You got her. You got her. That's it. We're slow. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Here's that. Yay! Yeah, perfect. Yeah, you just gotta you, you just gotta trust yourself and you're gonna trust the bike. You picked up a little too much speed there at one point. Yeah. But that was because you took your right foot off the brake. Off the brake, yeah. Which I get, it's, it's natural to feel that sensation and of wanting to put your foot down, but you'll overcome that. Yeah. And it's hard. Well, it's not hard. It's just when I don't, I'm still getting used to keeping my right foot 
I've heard enough excuses. Let's carry on. I was just trying to explain it. No, I know. I'm just being a dick. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Continue. Oh my God. Explain it gonna, and ride. Uh, what I was gonna say was I was just gonna fling my bloodstone for having that stupid heel on them. Well, you'll just feel like every other motorcyclist then blaming either their tires, their suspension, their ground clearance, their boots, Perfect. or some so other right bullshit. Like well, you just... <laughs> As someone who's known a lot of those people, just don't be that person. <laughs> oh, don't want me to be that person. Oh. No! No! This is a V-Strom off-road channel. That, that bullshit needs to just die now. Yeah, you're doing good. I'm just following your line, seeing what oh, you picked, Jesus. actually. Okay, well, you know me, you don't pick the best line. No, you're doing good. Yeah, you got those nice fat tires. Yeah, Hold yeah. On. I flicked it into neutral. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how. Oh, look at that beautiful river down there. I'm not looking, because I don't want to go in there. <laughs> good call, good call, good call. <laughs> Always freaks me out when you and Jeff are like, what? That's you. That was me? Yeah, you're the one setting off your horn, not me. <laughs> My motorcycle skills are good, but not good enough to turn on someone else's horn. Well, I thought it might have been you because I crossed over. No. I thought no. you were honking at me. No, not yet. No, you're, you're good. If I'm gonna make a sharp crossover, I've been telling you because I don't want you to. Well, I also. <laughs> I've been in your shoes. I know what you're gonna do. <laughs> to some extent. I mean, there's always the unpredictability of the predictable beginner, but at the same and time. You know me, and you probably know what I'm gonna do. Well, to some extent. Like, I would not have chosen that line. That was ballsy. Oh! <laughs> that seems to be the theme of the day for me. That's I'm fair. pretty sure we are going to the right. So get some momentum, put it in second. Just track her through, cover that clutch. Well, momentum is going to help you on that hill, okay? Momentum? Yeah. You're gonna see that on the camera later and be like, that was such a boss move, bitch. Cool, this is where we're parking. Going out of Crystal Falls. I mean, unless you want to drive all the way up and around. <laughs> I figured as much. <laughs> 